your boy Kevin Trujillo back on the Institute shit. How y'all doing, niggas? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Your nigga got his whip back, bruh. I finally got my goddamn whip back. But it's not the best. It's not. It's not working the best it could be working right now. But I finally got my shit back. The nigga, he didn't fix the shit, bruh. He just messed up even more. But I got my shit back. That's all that matters. But today, I want to talk about the, the turn, the time I got turned the fuck up the most and lit in a bit. And it was so crazy that y'all niggas be like, "Damn, man." This was a minute ago, bro. This was when, um, this was like by high school time, bro. This is like after high school, like a year or two after high school. This was the littest shit that ever, like, this was one of the littest parties I ever went to, bro. It was, uh, I went with my boys. It was, it was my one, my boy named Kaylin, and the other, and it was another boy. I forgot the nigga name. And we were lit in the bitch. My homeboy was like, he hit me up out of nowhere. And he was like, man, come on. He was like, man, come on. Let's go to a party or something. I said, you want to go to a party? And he said, yeah, let's go to a motherfucking party. So I said, bet, let's go to a party. And um, the party was in the country. It was a, it was a far country. The party was like... Fucking 30 to 40 minutes. The party was lit as hell, though. The, um, how we was getting out there was crazy, though. He was driving. And, um, and we were lit in the bitch. We, um, we, we drove like 45 minutes to get down there. It was a Mexican party. It was a Mexican party. As soon as we got out there, bruh, everybody was already turned in a bitch, bruh. I'm telling you, people was turned. Um, everybody was dancing, bruh. Um, when we first got there, it was two white girls. They were lit to the bitch. These hoes was dancing, and they these hoes was dancing, and they was already drunk. By the time we got there, this was because we got there like at ten or eleven or something like that. And the nigga, the white people, the white girls were already drunk. The Mexicans, they had a table. A table full of liquor, bruh. It was a table full of liquor. And, um, I'm like, I'm looking at the goddamn table. I'm like, damn. You know what I'm saying? Like, who just had, I was like, damn, nigga, really got a table full of liquor. You know what I'm saying? They had, um, they had just table full of every type of liquor you could think of. So we were just vi- I was just vibing at first, you know what I'm saying? Listening to music, getting kind of turned off, just turn, just regular turn. You did, and um, shit. The um, later on to the party, my boy was like, "Man, go on, drink some of these bottles." I said, "Bet," you know what I'm saying? Cause he's like, like I said, it was a table for liquor. So the nigga hand me a bottle, bruh. I tell you, bruh, when I started drinking from that bottle, I was like this, the whole, like, I like this at the party. I had, like, a big-ass bottle. I was like this, pause, drinking the, um, goddamn liquor. But then, he gave me another bottle. I had two bottles. That shit was crazy. You know what I'm saying? I had two bottles in my hand. So, uh, the nigga... I'm drinking like the bottle from this pause and like the other one. So we, I'm just drinking a bit. You know what I'm saying? Getting turned, just dancing and shit. You know, listening to music and everything. So, as soon as I started drinking from the bottles, I started dancing. With every, like with the people and stuff, we started dancing and shit. We was like, hey, 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 you know what I'm saying? Dancing like, little a bitch. So, um, all of a sudden I blacked out. I blacked out. All I remember was straight blank because I was dancing with these. I was dancing with these females. Then we started dancing all around. Then it just like everything went blank. You did the shit was crazy. Like I never had an experience where I'm drinking some liquor and just everything just go blank and I don't remember something right right at that moment, bruh. 
Okay, so we was drunk, and I got and I and, 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 and um and I blacked out. So when I was, you know, what I'm saying I'm already lit. I woke up, bruh. I don't know why, but I was, you know, so I blacked out. But I was standing behind this female, behind this Mexican girl. But I was like, I said, I was blacked out. You know, what I'm saying I blacked out. I don't know what I was doing. So I'm behind this Mexican female. And, uh, she was sitting down in this goddamn chair. You know what I'm saying? So, I was grabbing on her titties. Crazy. Yeah, the shit was crazy. I was grabbing on her titties and everything. But, um, uh, and she was just sitting down. She was, she was liking it. And, um, she was a cutie too. She was a real cutie. And, um, her boyfriend. Crazy. Her boy, she had a boyfriend. That, that, that's what made it hard, bruh. Her boyfriend was just looking at us, bruh. Her boyfriend was just, um, he was looking at us, you know what I'm saying? I was sitting, he, she was sitting down. And I was grabbing her titty. Then, um, he was just standing there looking the other way. Crazy. And I guess he looked like he kind of sad, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I, you know what I'm I can't do nothing. I blacked out. If I blacked out and your girl let me do that, you dig. I don't know what to tell you. So, uh, I guess her friends saw us, uh, saw us on her. And, you know what I'm saying? Because she was just, she was just vibing. And, uh, her friends took her away, um, uh, from us. And they had, um, uh, they had, they had took her inside. Cause I guess, like I said, she had a boyfriend. And, um, it's kinda hard to kinda remember what happened next. I don't know if, okay, they took her inside. We were just vibing. You know what I'm saying? We were just really vibing. Then, okay, we started dancing and shit. Then everybody was saying, the police came. The police was coming. The police coming. So everybody turned. You know, everybody drunk as hell. Everybody just don't know what they doing. We high drunk off of everything. And, um, and they were like, get no trash pass. Get a sign. Write no trash passing on it. If you get a sign and you write no trash passing on it, they, they can't come on the building. They can't come on the field. So, um. So we're like, yeah, let's do it, let's do it. And you know, we all drunk, you know what I'm saying? We don't know what we doing, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, cause we're in the country though. So, uh, but then the, everything just died down about the, um, police, you know what I'm saying? We were just, then we just started vibing again. So, we went in the damn, we went, okay, we went in the damn crib. And, we, you know what I'm saying? We were just throwing goddamn fruit around. <laughs> we was throwing, we were throwing fruit. That shit was crazy, bro. They had like a basket full of fruit. And we all sat down on the table. And, um, and we were just throwing the goddamn fruit around. And everybody was catching it. We were throwing it. People were trying to catch the bit. <laughs> that shit was stupid. Then, um, then I guess the girl had came out the room again. The, um, the girl that we were still on her titties, she, I guess she came out the room. And, um, I guess she was calling for a nigga. I don't remember. The girl was calling for a nigga or something. And, um, then, uh, I guess they took her back in the room. My little, my little dumb ass. I was just chilling, you know what I'm saying? I, heard, I guess I heard her calling. Then we, uh, I went up in the room. And the girl was reaching for me. You know what I'm saying? Like, she was trying to grab me. But her friends wouldn't let her get off the bed. You know what I'm saying? Because she was laying down on the bed. And the girl was trying to call for me. And she was reaching for me. Like, when I went up in the room. Because I was trying to get up in the door for some reason. Like, you know what I'm saying? I was going crazy type shit. I was trying to open the door. And the friends were trying to close the door. And they were trying to hold me back. And they were trying to hold her back. I don't get it, bruh. This, this shit was stupid, bruh. And, um, eventually, they closed the door and everything. And, um, 
and we about to leave. Then we went, then we went outside again, cause that, that's where the party was, and we were just vibing and shit. The all I remember is my boy. We was <laughs> I was trying to dance, and my homeboy. Um, I guess some some shit was happening, bro. And he grabbed me, and he drove me to the car because. Like I said, I was drunk off of two damn bottles, bruh. Again, turned in the bitch. And he drove me to the car. And I got inside the car. And I, well, as soon as I got in the car, bruh, I blacked out. I don't remember what the fuck happened. But I, as long as I know, I, we, I got to the crib. And I was laying down on the bed. And I woke up. And as soon as I woke up. I was about to throw up, I was like, bruh, like that, but I didn't throw up, I never threw, I never threw up at a party before, or again, turned off some liquor, I never threw up off of that shit, cause you know what I'm saying, my body's strong for that, but yeah, that, my body built for that, built ass, but, uh, yeah, and, and, and that shit was so fucking turned, bruh, I woke up the next day, about to throw up, my, my boy like, damn, last night was crazy as hell, I said, yeah, it was, bruh. That was the first time I ever went to, like, a, a, a party in the country like that. Uh, like, a, like a Mexican, it was a Mexican party. And, and it was so turnt, bruh. The hoes there. Man. It was so fucking lit. Uh, every time I see my boys, I'm, I'm always gonna bring that shit up when we got turnt. And we got lit. And, uh... And the crazy thing, I never seen that girl again. I said, never seen the Mexican people again. But I seen my boys again. But I never seen the Mexican people again. And it was lit in a bitch. And uh, and I enjoyed myself. He did. I mean, you know what I'm saying? That shit happens. I didn't. Get the, the female, she was crazy. I was crazy. So, but uh, that shit was crazy. Fuck with your boy, that was the story time when I got turned the fuck up the most and lit. And, um, and, um, fuck with your boy. I'm gonna have more shit from the north side, you dig? And, um, uh, like, subscribe, comment, share the video if you feel like you want to share the motherfucking video. And, um, stay tuned with your boy. And, yeah, do see.